Hello traders, today's highlights, the Bank of Japan has kept its monetary policy intact and global investors will get a chance to change their cautious sentiment before the weekend ensues. It's Friday, June 16th and here is our daily market review. Wall Street produced a cautious trading session on Thursday. The Nasdaq slump continued and the index has now produced slightly negative results the past month. Building permits data will come from the states today along with housing starts figures. Yesterday's manufacturing index reports from the Philly Fed and New York Fed were stronger than forecasted. Political rumblings from Washington will continue to get attention going into the weekend, but for the time being, do not appear to be an immediate threat to investor sentiment. The Dow Jones, S&P and Nasdaq remain near record highs and traders will get a chance to become speculative before the weekend. The Bank of Japan kept its monetary policy in place early this morning. The central bank admitted conditions remain challenging regarding its economy. Its labor market is tight, but growth remains troubling, inflation is well below its target, and rising costs for the government is a concern. The yen has weakened against the US dollar and is above the 111 mark. The Nikkei has climbed in value along with the Topics Index. Interestingly, foreign direct investment numbers into China showed a drop yesterday. The Shanghai Shenzhen Composite has been slightly negative early today. European equities remained cautious on Thursday as selling throughout the major indexes continued on the continent. The Bank of England offered no surprises yesterday and the pound has remained in a stable range against the US dollar with the 1.28 level remaining a focal point. French inflation statistics came in below expectations yesterday and trade balance numbers for the European Union were negative. Today a consumer price index report will be released and provide more insights regarding inflation for the European Union. The euro has been weaker against the US dollar the past day, but last night the Greek government announced it has reached a new deal extending its debt payments timetable. Crude oil remains a tantalizing market for traders entering Friday. The commodity has been under constant pressure the past two weeks. The 44 US dollar a barrel price is now short-term support. Speculative elements will continue to spark the crude oil market as it tries to escape the rampant selling which has pushed its value downwards. The building's permits numbers from the US could prove interesting for traders when they are released at 1230 GMT. Thank you for watching. Have a good trading day and we'll see you again soon.